Hi, my name is Parag Hawaldar and I am from Los Angeles. I work for Blizzard Entertainment, which is a very uh, well-known game company. And I work in the cinematics department there, trying to develop tools for R&D that are used to you know, great, uh, create cinematics. So currently we are involved in making cinematics for games. Cinematics are high quality renders that go along with the game development so that uh, people know, I mean, game players know what the story is about, how things are done, and you know, explores more about the levels in the game. And it's a very uh, nice way of introducing players to the game. I have uh, uh, been involved in, in, in this industry for a long time. It's a combination of art and, and, and a lot of computer graphics. Uh, from a art side, there's a lot of you know, artistry that you need to learn, but I come from the technical side. I went to uh, graduate school and I did a PhD in computer science and computer graphics in particular and that's what got me to you know, what I'm doing these days. So from my own perspective, I think uh, when you go to a university you learn a lot about the technology, the mathematics, uh, you know, the algorithms for computer graphics and to generate stuff. But ultimately if you're working in this industry, there is something you need to learn about how a production works, the fact that uh, all the technologies that you learn have to serve the art, serve the purpose of creating art. And uh, what you don't get to get or learn in, in school is really work in a production environment. So my advice is to try to go to you know different companies uh, to do an internship, so you can get a good understanding of how productions work. Computer graphics is a field that has been evolving all the time. You know from the point of film and cinematics to games and so on and every year there's been, there's been progress, sometimes there's incremental progress, sometimes there's great progress and I think uh, in future we'll have really uh, you know, real, -time, uh, real time feedback from, uh, from computer, uh, computer game cards, we'll have a lot of uh, you know, real visual uh, lighting models, we'll have real uh, you know, humans, human like humanoid uh, 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 renderings of, uh, of characters and it will soon start to, in the future we will start to bridge the gap between reality and virtual reality to become you know, very, 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 very true.